Aloha, it's Chandler Rose, and I have Evie here. She's my little min pin puppy. She's about eight years old now. And this is a video for massage you can do with your own dog. Yeah, it's really relaxing for your furry friend, also relaxing for you to spend a little time with them. So I have some organic essential oils that my dogs love. They have ingredients in them that I formulate myself that are very relaxing. So it's safe for them to lick their fur. It's also very good for dogs that may have anxiety. Any dogs that are sensitive to separation. Um, it's also great for that. Evie knows she's had these oils almost her whole life, so she is very familiar. They taste good, clearly. So I'm just gonna start by letting her smell the oils. If you're making a dog oil at home, you can use um, coconut. I like to use hemp seed and sunflower. Those are both very safe for dogs. Um, this one has some flower oils, rose and chamomile. So I'm just gonna let her taste and smell the oil first. And then, just like you, I start with some Swedish effleurage down the back. Not all dogs will love these kind of oils, but I do make oils for lots of different breeds. And groomers who work with dogs, that's a great addition to their business because it's really nice to groom a dog that is somewhat relaxed. It's also very good for their coat and skin. Miniature pinchers specifically tend to have really dry skin. You don't want to over shampoo them. Um, so using oils is a really great way to nourish their skin. So I'm gonna just do a little petrissage on the neck. Behind the ears, there are these places that are very relaxing. You can do little circles. Also, Evie has a little neck tension due, from, due to wearing her collar a lot. She also is a pretty muscular breed, so she's got some hypertonicity in the neck. So just opening up her neck likes these oils. I'll let her do that for a second. Can you lay down? Shh. Good girl. And then, oh, sorry Eeps. You can gently roll them on their back. <laughs> you don't want to be on your back? Okay. <laughs> How about just like that? Is that okay? Yeah? You're not quite ready for the back? Being on your back? Alright, so I'm going to keep her this way. coming into her neck. This is a new space for Evie. She might be more into a tummy rub if she's at home, or maybe I can just rub her or scratch her belly from this position. What I hear most about from people when they're asking about dog massage or how to relax their dog is um, hip hip stuff, hip dysplasia, hip tension, hip pain. So you can work on the hips just by locating the joint where you feel the connections, which is usually right in the center of that kind of turkey leg looking structure on the back, similar to, to people, I guess. Um, and then just using your fingers and doing little circles in. I like to do a little hold you can take one thumb on each side of the hips and just sink in. The 
I notice, because I do work with dogs pretty often, even just a simple hold or like a, what we would call a trigger point in regular massage is enough to relax them. So I just have one hand on her hips and one hand on her back. Evie loves running. She loves going on walks. We do at least three walks a day. She also is very interested in squirrels. She's very interested in cats. We like to try to be friendly with kitties, even though you can tell when I say that word, she's like, where is it? Right? Some of you that watch our videos maybe know that we have Sophia, who's a beautiful kitten, part of our team. And she likes to tease Evie a little bit, like cats like to do. Right? Evie likes to take naps. She likes to hang out with her friends. She lives right now in a place with three other dogs. So they're all small dogs. So they like to go on walks together and run around the yard together and locate squirrels together. And I'm just doing a little rotation in that, that hip joint. You'll notice with miniature pinchers or small dogs, a lot of times their joints are really tight. So you can work around near the elbows, near the shoulders, doing little circles in the neck. Evie has very alert ears when she's focused, so that's kind of a good indicator of what she's focused on. also really likes kids. She grew up with my daughter and she loves her and she loves guarding her. Miniature Pinchers are great little guard dogs. And they're super, super smart. So find some time for yourself to get some massage. Find some time for your puppy cat if they're wanting massage. You can do a little massage near the, the chest or under the head. watching dogs when they're dreaming. Sometimes they're chasing squirrels. Sometimes you'll see their little feet move. Maybe you'll hear little sounds, little barking sounds. The wonderful part about giving your dog attention is that there is this oxytocin released between you and your animal which is what makes us feel relaxed and sleepy and sometimes hungry, right? Evie's thinking about food. She loves string cheese. She doesn't get it very often, but if you ever open string cheese in the same house as Evie, she will run and find you. 
little yawn happening. Yeah. Massage is good for dogs with skin issues, especially if you have an organic oil. I notice more often than not, their, people's dogs, their skin is just dry, so it's important to not over shampoo them. Use an oil or a spray that helps with moisturizing. And some of that can have a connection to diet as well, kind of like us if you're eating too many things that create heat in the body. Um, salt, sugar, too much protein, all that can create disturbances in the skin. So with dogs and with humans, you have this ability to open up the muscle, but you also are affecting the skin, the outer layer of the body, which is our part of our immune system. You know, it's, it's the layer that protects us from viruses. found this video helpful and relaxing and we'd love to hear from you if there's any dog questions you might have. I just want to thank Evie for being my friend over the years. She's super special to me and my daughter. to just say thank you for checking out this video. I hope you're feeling more relaxed. I hope your, your dog is feeling happier and more connected to you and your family. And, and we'll talk to you soon. If you enjoy these videos, please join us at PsycheTruthPatrons.com for dozens of exclusive videos and premium programs. We have over a thousand videos you won't find on YouTube, such as modeling and fashion hauls, exclusive massage videos, ASMR, behind the scenes, bloopers, and much more. It's a great way to help us keep the cameras rolling so we can continue making the content you love. Patrons will get two to three new exclusive videos each week, so I hope you'll consider joining our Patreon family today. Just visit PsycheTruthPatrons.com.